Well, picked up this old uh, ATV frame. I got a little bit of a front suspension there. And no back part anymore. I just cut it off in half. Because the rear axle, the way I want the sprocket to go, is on the wrong side. I had to make it bigger anyways for my engine. I was going to chop it anyways. All I have to do is spin it around. See, here's my my rear axle. Well, the sprocket goes here. And it's on the other side. So, there we go. Custom. Alrighty, going for the big weld. I'm going to grind on these edges here. There's the big gap. They're upside down right now. But I'm going to grind them and I'll weld them right to that frame. So the frame that was pre-built, well, it's coming apart. And it's going onto this one. Cast on. Alrighty. After all that, here we go. Got them all tack welded up. The bracing. Two main runners attached to the other part. Now, the sprocket's going to be on the right side. Match up with the engine. So, there it is here. Goes right out to that end. To that end. Got my sprocket here. It's a weldable one, but since uh, my axle has four holes, I'm just going to drill out four holes. So, pre drill. Well, working on the chain now. Got to line it up for the master link to the engine, so we'll get it there. 